Hi everyone, uh, this is how to set up Mac OS X server for our presentation and demo purposes. So if you have a Mac Mini server or you've just uh, installed Mac OS X server into a computer and you restart, um, you will see this welcome screen. So you choose Malaysia as the country, you choose the keyword layout, and you enter the Mac OS X uh, serial number. So if you have a Mac Mini server, you should have the serial number as part of the package. Then here you click on uh, set up a new server. You can leave this blank, click on uh, continue, click on continue, and set the time zone. So here I've set it to Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Now here, uh, put in the username and password for the local administrator and put in the IP address. Now, depending on the environment, you might want to change this. My normal IP address that I put in is 10.1.0.1, subnet mask is 255.255.0.0, and router 10.1.0.1. Um, in the slide shown here, I've put it 10.0.1.201, uh, 255.255.255.0, and 10.1.0.1.1 because I'm using this with an access point. You will notice I uh, don't actually put in DNS server in search domain. And uh, when I put in this uh, DNS here, mini.example.com, and the computer name is mini, uh, the Mac OS X server will actually create uh, a DNS entry on its own uh, in itself, so it will be the DNS server for itself and thus will be able to do forward and reverse lookups on mini.example.com. So here I click on create users and groups. I can configure everything manually, but normally I do this because it's a lot faster. So you can see all the services already configured by default. Now, since this is just for a demo or test purpose, I'm not going to back up any client machines to my computer. So I uh, deselect this tick box. And this, I just leave it blank. Uh, a lot of the customers that I visit either have Exchange-based or Gmail-based uh, mail servers. So generally, we don't really need to have yet another mail server in the mix. And then we click on Setup. And after the computer has restarted, you come and see the uh, Mac OS X server user interface. So server preferences launches automatically and shows you all the services that are set up. So server preferences is a really easy way to create users. So I'll go ahead and create uh, some users here. So you just click on the plus button, put in the teacher one, short name teacher one, password, and uh, click on create account. So here I've created three teachers and three students. Then when you click on the show all button, you can click on groups. Then here you can see I've created one group for students, and I've added all the three students to the student group. And I've added uh, three teachers to the teachers group. Then uh, you close. Uh, server preferences and you run server admin. So when you run server admin, uh, what I want to do now is turn on podcast producer. So you go to settings and you enable podcast producer. So there's a configure button. You click on continue. You click on express setup click on continue, click on continue. Here you put in the directory credentials, the directory administrator credentials, uh, normally the username. Here's your admin password is the same as the password you use for the local administrator password. So click on continue and the wizard does the rest. And that's uh, how easy it is to set up Mac OS X server. And uh, if you need to contact me, you can always email me at shah at mac.com. Thank you.